Well, the thrill is gone and the honeymoon's over. This is what we're dealing with on day two of the van restoration. Now, this might be a 10 year project, but we're gonna get it done. Look right here. We dealing with dead rat bones. We dealing with the black plague. We dealing with some type of general, I don't know, looks like a goddamn bunch of pulled up blood like somebody's murdered in his sentence. We don't care. We gonna exercise the demons and heal the sick. Oh, and I've had small victory already. I could probably call it a day and feel like I succeeded. This door would previously not open. It is open. I WD, I ain't WD 40 them yet, but I'm going to, I'm trying not to lie. And but to give an accurate documentation for future generations, cause I don't know if y'all know it or not. Kids are gonna look back and read about this bullshit time we're in. In the, in the, in the annals of history. They call it the annals of history for a reason, cause it's a bunch of shit. Anywho, so I'm trying to document what was really going on during the apocalypse. They gonna read about toilet paper shortages and whatnot. I'm just letting them know they were some part of America that's still free and we were dealing with real issues like funk in the band. And I've come to the conclusion there's just some things I'm not going to be able to salvage. I don't want to break this thing down to bare bones. I want to salvage what I can, but I feel like it's my duty. No, I, I'm probably gonna have to rip this whole interior out. What am I talking about? I damn mean, anybody can do this. Looking for somebody to restore a van for about $30. I'm trying to find, trying to find a way to get, what the fuck is that shit? Oh look, it's fucking Donald Trump's. Oh hell, it's a fucking head. Oh hell. Oh hell, there's a head in here. Oh, it's, <laughs> y'all think I'm fucking kidding, I ain't. I damn look at that shit. What the goddamn fuck is really going on? What the fuck is really going on? Oh, damn. Ooh, and it's got snap. Oh, hell. God damn. Ew. Oh, shit. I mean, I, I'm going to tell you. My life has been one fucking episode of the Twilight Zone after another. And that ain't, I ain't even kidding when I say that. Everybody's all tripping out. Oh, hell. Well, the rear view mirror is stuck down in the spark plug hole. Hmm. Well, I'm committed to it now. You know what I mean? Oh, there it is. It ain't in that hole. It ain't a spark plug hole. Oh, yeah. and what the fuck is it? I don't know, dude. I mean, I don't know a lot about cars. Like I said, look. Uh -huh. The rear view is intact. I don't know how we're gonna get. Oh, you gotta get that glue. Look at that shit. I don't need no fucking rear view. I ain't never. I don't look back. I don't look back. I put the pedal down and look forward. You see that blinker come on, you better get the fuck. Oh, look, we got some matches once they work. These son bitches are pro. Oh, it's brand new. Look. We're going to test these matches. They've been in here for since the 90s. Let's see if we can make them work. Watch this. Here we go. Watch this, Bob. Hey! And God said. No, he said let there be light, not fire. All right, we're going to keep them. Survival 101. I think I found the hood latch thing. I think it's called a uh, hood latch release cable or something. I mean, well, I fuck. I, I mean, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn this damn bitch over today. Come hell or high water. But here's what you know, Lord willing, and the creeks don't rise. Look at that shit, dude. I mean, if I could get to the battery compartment from here, I'd just do that. But I mean, I right, Lord help us. A TV and an auxiliary. I wonder what that aircraft thing does. I mean, this motherfucker had radar. This motherfucker's got radar. <laughs> I done said that once. I better get back to work. I see I'm making videos to have an excuse not to get finished today. <laughs> oh, hell, this ain't good. Oh, I cannot believe that shit. I have dropped my goddamn phone down in the motor. 